Hello from Slovenia again. Uh, today I will do a, a spiral, reverse spiral dip with wet paper towel. I didn't do this a long, long time. I think uh, paint with um, uh, flower with uh, wet paper towels. So <clears throat> uh, let's see what we can get. I didn't uh, try it yet uh, with this spiral technique when I did this. Um, paper towel technique I didn't do spirals yet so let's see what will happen and I think that I don't have enough paint because for this um, uh, paper towel technique you will need a little more paint on the surface because paper towel lifts some of your paint of the canvas so you have to make sure that you have enough paint uh, I'm playing lately with some different techniques and uh, different pouring mediums mixtures of different pouring mediums I love to try some new things that's why this uh, art is so uh, interesting because you can play with different ingredients and um, see what you will get out of it and I just love to play around and I did some jewelry I will show you in one video the, that too because um, sometimes I when I do flower dips I use my paint on the surface for jewelry so or skin so uh, I just don't waste paint so don't want to waste paint that's why I use it for cards or jewelry or whatever you can do a lot of things with it so I was just popping their bubbles um, and I have some browns and blues today <coughs> This is greenish blue from Amsterdam and let's start. Circle first and I didn't do it okay again. I will do a little more of this blue on the edge and this is metallic bronze
And I have burnt sienna. Oops. And phthalo blue. These blues are similar but different. And next I will add this pearl white and I think that I should add a little more of this blue because I almost lost it And dark brown. And now I will just spray my paper towel with water to wet it down a little bit and I don't want to press it too hard I will just go around a little bit and now I will lift it the corners first and then these corners And I think that colors are gorgeous, but I'm not sure about the whole composition. I will torch it a little bit to pop up these air bubbles. touch here in the middle you see how different it, it is when you uh, do it with paper towel or um, with the reverse dip when you do a reverse dip with paper towel or with um, saran wrap or other things that you can use you pull your paint towards the center so your flower is smaller then uh, when you do a regular dip um, you get uh, you spread your paint so you get more uh, bigger flower or how can I say that but I really like it I don't know has some beautiful details and this lacing and 
but I wish I had more blue. I was hoping for more blue. But it's still nice, I think. I will show you the result. It is, uh, it has blue tones and blue lacing and everything, see? But I was hoping for more blue. But you know already. You can't always get what you want. So tell me what do you think about this flower? <clears throat> I think that it has some three-dimensional look and some nice details and color combination is nice or I don't know I like it so tell me what you think about this have you tried with paper towel yet if you do tell me what how how it works for you and see you on the next one. Bye!